Hello visitors, welcome to the Google Labs training tutorials by Techbridge Solutions once again. This is Ashwin and in this video we are going to see about the organization of your chat list and adding and removing contacts from your chat list. So first of all, after you log in into your Gmail, you can add a contact in several ways. So first of all, if you receive any mail from any person, for example, if you see this third mail and just click on it, if I open it in the right side, I can see the details of the particular person. So I can see an option here, invite Ashwin Kumar Sarangula to chat. That is for every message you, see, you receive, you can have an option to invite the particular person to chat with you and you can simultaneously add those person into the uh, contact list. So this is the way you can initiate the chat with them. So now moving to the customization of your chat list. If you just click on this drop down menu, you can just go here. You can have options here. See, show in the chat list. That is the most popular contacts. You can show in this tiny or small accounts or medium or large accounts. So it depends on your choice and if it is up to the all contacts and every contact will be appear in your chat list and if you want to add any contact just click here add contact and see you can just type the email address here for example I'll just type an address see I'll just send invites see I've sent an invitation see it appears the new name appears here again and as soon as the other person accepts my invitation then I can see whether the person is available for chat or not and start a chat with the person if the person is available for chat and now coming to the controlling the chat list in Gmail if you just go to the settings by clicking the gear icon Pardon. Yes, settings now. And go to the chat section here. See, as I've mentioned earlier, the auto add suggested contacts. See, sometimes as you have sent an invitation, if any other person have sent you a request for chat, and if you have accepted the request, and you can customize that. You can allow only those people to allow chat and uh, you can block the other people in your chat list. That is this option. See, only allow people that have explicitly approved to chat with me and see who when I am online. So you can check this option if you want to get rid of those people and just click the save changes. Let's just click cancel and in this way you can manage your chat list and if you want to remove any particular contact from your chat list or block then you can just go here just click on this block else leave it and one more thing is that if you just go to the contacts See if I move the cursor to any particular contact, if I see here there is a drop down menu just click on it. See I have option here send SMS that means you can even continue a chat or SMS here. So you can choose whether to show the particular contact in the chat list always or it is auto or never show or block the particular person. So it depends upon you again and in this way you can perform several operations on your chat list and this is it for this video and thanks for watching my videos and please like our videos and subscribe to our channel if you like it and stay tuned for more videos from our channel and thank you